Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Gabriella. I make videos about fragrance, astrology, self-care, mental health, life as an actor. I do vlogs and basically whatever else I feel like talking about. So if that sounds like your jam, please stick around and subscribe. Today I have one of my favorite kinds of videos to make and I'm sure you can tell, duh, if you've read the title or seen the thumbnail, we're doing a Bath and Body Works haul because they have their Christmas stuff out and today was the last day that they were doing $10 off of three wick candles and I never pay full price for a three wick candle darling I really do not so I had to speed over there and pick up my holiday stuff so I'm super excited because I love I love Bath and Body Works call me basic whatever you're just a hater because listen it brings me joy and we need a little joy right now this is um Oh, this is crazy. This is the day before election day. So when you see this, we will know the results of the election. Um, but I'm feeling quite anxious and I need Christmas. We need a little Christmas right this very minute. We have the election. Who is gonna win it? And we need a little... Guys, oh my God, I'm an amazing songwriter. I just did that. I literally just made that up myself. I mean, that. I just rewrote that song. I'm amazing. Anyway, let's begin. Okay. So I got some candles. The first one I got is Sugared Snickerdoodle. This is just cookie dough sweet sugar cookie. So good. It has cute little baking paraphernalia on the label. And yeah, if you guys, uh, if you've watched my candle hauls before, you know I love gourmand scents. I love things that smell edible, baked goods, pancakes, waffles, Cupcake, sugar, anything with that in the title, I'm gonna like it. Or uh, in the name, I guess. So yeah, sugared snickerdoodle, very happy with that one. That is just a t very typical gobby apartment smell. Then, ooh, I got another white barn candle. This is vanilla balsam. So they had a balsam one and I was like, ooh, that smells like a Christmas tree farm and I loved it, but I'm a vanilla girl. I gotta have a little bit of vanilla in there and I love this color, it's so festive. And this smells, oh, I can, it, it, I can tell when I burn this, it's almost gonna feel like it's snowing outside, or it's almost gonna feel like I'm in cold weather even though I live in Los Angeles. Yeah, it just smells like uh, Christmas trees. Do I smell the vanilla? Maybe, it's just like sweet, sweet Christmas trees. It's not super cutting and in your face, it's just, oh, that's Christmas. Then I got a Bath and Body Works can a Bath and Body Works candle called Sar Salted Caramel Eggnog. <laughs> salted Caramel Eggnog. Guys, say that three times fast. I'm not crazy. Salted Caramel Eggnog. Salted Caramel. Someone's gonna be like, I could say it. No problem. Congrats on your tongue. Salted Caramel Eggnog. Salted car Salted Caramel Eggnog. Salted Caramel. Okay. <laughs> this is Salted Caramel Eggnog. Got some holographic, I don't know if they're holographic, but sort of shiny snowflakes. Yeah, and this is similar to the sugar cookie one. It's just a little bit more, it has a little bit more of that dairy note that I smell whenever they do like a, a cream cheese cupcake or like a something, blueberry cream cheese. Any, any note that like, any candle that has dairy, like eggnog, there's that kind of like sour, sweet sour note in a good way. It's like Greek yogurt kind of. So it's sweet with a little bit of that tang. Tang, we love tang. So that's good. That is salted caramel eggnog. I said it right that time. And the last candle I got is their brand new fragrance called You're the One. And I love this candle anyway. I'm, I say it in every video, red's my power color. In my mid 20s, I am very attracted to the color red. And I just think this is beautiful. I think I'm gonna put it in my room. My room is mostly neutral, so it'll be a fun pop of color because my room is kind of Scandinavian neutral. This candle is actually light pink. And I can't remember the notes. Uh, oh, white birch, velvety rose, and a drop of strawberry nectar with essential oil. So yeah, I smell the rose and it's, I don't know if it's just a drop of strawberry nectar, honey, because it's pretty fruity, but yeah, this is super girly. This reminds me of like college uh, body, like, yeah, it kind of just smells like body spray, but I don't know why it like comforts me. And you know what? I don't live with anybody else. I can have 
slightly tacky scents to be nostalgic. I don't know if it's tacky, but you know what I mean? It's like that flirty body spray floral smell and it's fun. I think it's fun. So that is You're the One. Those were all the candles that I got. Let's move on to hand soaps. I got four hand soaps. They were having four for 20, I think. And we are in the season of hand soap. I mean, not the season. Hopefully we all get a bit better about doing that for the rest of our lives. But the first one I got is Fresh Balsam from White Barn. And they're doing, I don't know how long they've been doing this, but they're doing this thing where it's not exactly square. It's a, what would you call this shape? This is a po poly, poly, polygon? No, rhombus. I don't know, it might be a rhombus. It's that. It's like you took a square and you went bam. You see that? Eh. So when it's standing up, it's kind of cool looking. Um, I also just love uh, this, this color of green. And I found this, it just reminds me of a little cabin. So fresh balsam, I'll probably put this in the kitchen. I just have two sinks, kitchen and bathroom. But I don't know, we'll figure it out. Fresh balsam, coconut mint drop. This is their foaming soap. Um, and this is the gentle gel hand soap gel hand soap makes me feel a little bit cleaner for some reason So yeah coconut mint drop. I actually have not smelled this white coconut ice peppermint and winter musk. Oh That's absolutely delightful. Absolutely delightful. Oh my gosh. That reminds me a little bit of twisted peppermint, but less sweet uh, From like vanilla. Oh my gosh, that's so good. And it has a little fox If you can see there's a little fox guy, so that's very good. Then pumpkin cupcake. I will probably put this one out immediately because we're still in November. I don't need to be using all the Christmas scents right now, but pumpkin cupcake, like I said, I love anything, cupcake, all that. This is their gentle foaming hand soap. Baked pumpkin, whipped vanilla, frosting, and golden honey. I think I've had this in a candle or something similar. I don't know, I just knew I'm, I just know I'm gonna like it, so. Yep, that's just sweet. Pumpkin-y autumn deliciousness. It's warm. Oh, so good. And the last one I got is White Barn Flannel Gentle Foaming Hand Soap. So yeah, it's just navy and kind of oatmeal colored. So I like that some of these are clearly very Christmassy. And then this one, you know, even after Christmas is over in January, February, I can still use this because it doesn't look super Christmassy. So this kind of smells like, um, like, did I just get that on my shirt? No. This kind of smells like men's cologne. It says crisp autumn air, heirloom mahogany and cedar wood. So it's very woody. It's very, uh, I would think of probably a lot of women if they're living with men or they are married to men or whatever, would probably get something like this because it's not gonna, you know, the guy's not gonna be like, my hands smell like a cupcake. Whatever, anyway, no men living with me, no men in my vicinity, in my home, thank the Lord, but, um, <laughs> No, men, you're cool, but you know, I'm good for now. Uh, this is flannel, anyway, super excited. Yeah, it's like a little bit of an Abercrombie type of smell, kind of like mahogany teak wood, teak wood mahogany, I don't know. Anyway, very good, I find it delicious. Oh, a couple things I got, um, so, let me reach in this bag. I have never used the Bath & Body Works car, uh, what do they call it, car fragrance things. I got this, it's like a cute little pom-pom because I saw the other ones they had which were like metal and rhinestones or metal and pearls and it's fine but like my car is pretty sporty, it's pretty cute, it's not like eleganza, like a, a, a Cadillac with a tan interior with the, my pearl air freshener, like I just was like am I going to really like that when I look at it um, and I only want to buy things that I really love so I found this one. So that's cool. That's you, you clip it to the visor, I guess, with this little clip. Because I'm, I'm into keeping, I think, I think the mark of a really mature adult, or at least making your, yourself feel like a really mature adult, is keeping your car clean. So I've been going to the car wash, even though I haven't been seeing anybody and my car is just parked out on the street. I go to the car wash, I do the interior, I get the little air freshener, so at least now I have an air freshener that's a little more me. So I got two of Pumpkin Cupcake which is the fragrance we just talked about. So my car is gonna smell like pumpkin cupcakes, it's gonna be great. And then Champagne Toast, which I can't remember. This one is a little more citrusy, I guess. Um, yeah, so this will probably last me through the holidays and then this one will be for late winter, spring. 
excited about that. Um, all right, next they were doing buy three, get three free for body care. So I got a lot of body care. Here's what I got. So while I was in the store, I was testing some of these out and I forgot how great the formula is for just their 24 hour moisture, their body lotion, like not their shea butter or anything. I really like this, this formula. I don't even think I got any of the, sh the shea. Oh well. Anyway, um, it looks like I got about four lotions. So this one is snowflakes and cashmere and I was shook when I smelled this. I haven't been in Bath and Body Works during the holidays for a couple years. I usually order online, but I haven't, you know, if I order online, I don't usually do body products because I don't want to risk it. This is vanilla cashmere cream, car caramel, caramel, caramel woods and frosted clementine. And this, how do I, like this reminds me of something from my past. This just smells, this is so elegant and this smells way more expensive than Bath and Body Works prices. I think it's beautiful and warm. It could melt in, like into a skin scent. It's great. So that is Snowflakes and Cashmere body lotion. And then I might as well just tell you that I got the, uh, oh, did I? Yeah, I got the Snowflakes and Cashmere fragrance mist as well. And it's, I, I know my ring light, <clears throat> I know my ring light is kind of light, so it's hard to see the packaging. So I'll try to put it far away, but it has like, yeah, little snowflakes and atomic stars and things like that. And it's just light pink and very pretty. I love this freaking fragrance, honestly, amazing. Then I got In the Stars, which is Starflower Sandalwood Musk, Sugared Tangelo, Tangelo, white agar wood and radiant amber so again another super warm fragrance i was shook when i smelled this i thought it was gonna it kind of reminds me of victoria's secret and i know they this they have the same manufacturer or something that does their products so i was expecting this sorry i just i'm getting a little obsessive here with my hair and the shirt okay um i <clears throat> was expecting this to smell really um floral and kind of like young but it's so good and i think it was this one i worked with a woman who used to spray this on herself after um after the show i did theater with with this young woman so she smelled so good and she would always share with me and i think it was this one it was one of them that's packaged like this they have a couple fragrances but i think it was this one and this is just also warm and delicious i want to wear this oh I want to wear this on a, a night walking through wintertime Chicago. I'm really longing for Chicago right now. I miss it. But man, this is good. I guess I, I can't even describe what I'm smelling. Does it remind me of anything? I don't know. It's warm, but it's bright. It's warm and really, really happy. So that's in the stars. And I believe I also got... Yes. I was just about to be so sad. I got the same fine fragrance mist. This is throwing me back. I, honestly, Bath and Body Works hauls, like they just connect me with my middle school self. <sighs> and I just was so happy picking these out. So I don't know. It just reminds me of, I used to go every season with my mom and then in college with my best friend Kira, we used to go every fall and then later in the winter to pick out scents for our dorm room and yeah, I'll get into that later. But anyway, in the stars, fine fragrance mist as well. Then I got, speaking of my friend Kira and our winter trips to Bath and Body Works, back when we lived in Boston, I used to wear, and I actually in high school and middle school, I think I've been wearing this for a long time, Twisted Peppermint. This is classic. I'm so glad that this is still available. This is just, I love peppermint. Peppermint is one of my favorite ice cream flavors, whether it's Christmas time or not. I love peppermint ice cream. Oh. And this is just, oh my gosh, this, it just takes me back. This takes me back to the house I grew up in, in, in Palatine, Illinois. I can literally smell, cause I used to have the, the body wash and everything. I can smell the bathroom and I can envision being in the bathroom getting ready when I smell this fragrance. 
Twisted Peppermint 24 Hour Body Lotion and the Twisted Peppermint Aloe and Vitamin E Shower Gel. I didn't get the body spray. Did I get a small one? No. No, I guess I didn't. Okay, well, I'll figure out. I don't know if I would wear peppermint body spray anymore, but the products, like to at home before a night of watching movies and chilling with mochi, like this is super cozy to me and just nostalgic. So I wanted to get that set. Then my last body lotion is Snowy Peach Berry. And I believe this is a new fragrance. And this is Snow Kissed Cranberries, Frosted Peach Blossom, and Shimmering Woods. And this is just peach, but creamy. And it's so freaking good. It's so optimistic and cheery. I just was shook when I smelled it. I just, yeah, and it's a little bit tart because of the cranberries as well. It's so good. Um, so I got that and I got the matching uh, fragrance mist. It's just kind of gold and silver shimmery. Oh, did I get two? Oh, besides the, the cashmere snowflakes and cashmere lotion and fine fragrance mist, I also got the shower gel. I guess I really liked that one. Then I got a you're the one shower gel because this fragrance to me, I, I thought about getting the perfume, but it's it's too, I don't know, it's not me, but in the shower, it's gonna make me feel very luxurious, very feminine. So, I got one of those. And then I picked up the White Pumpkin and Chai Fine Fragrance Mist. Um, this is just warm and it's a kind of a skin scent. And I love it, it's great. Um, super, super warm and cozy sweater weather fragrance. Whipped Almond Vanilla. I love almond. Ugh, it's hard to get off. Ooh, the mister is really nice these days. Yeah, this is just another sweet skin comforting scent. I got a lot of comforting, cozy, stay-at-home fragrances. There's not much to this. It's just sweet almondy vanilla. The parrots outside are losing their minds right now. And then I picked up Pink Velvet Cupcake, which I smelled right before I left. And this is... This is just sparkly, optimistic girliness. This is uh, marshmallow, praline, and red berries. So it's berry, but it's also kind of gourmandy and sweet. Love that. And then I just got a little vanilla buttercream shea butter hand cream. Because, I don't know, I, we need hand cream, right? We're washing our hands a lot. So that was my Bath and Body Works haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you have tried any of these fragrances or what you're kind of looking at, if you're going to get any, and I will talk to you in my next video. Love you guys so much. Bye guys.